utility scale versus tracker. So you can see we have our first uh, version one of this using trackers, and I'm going to go and create a new version, uh, version two, to show you a, a fixed alt example. Um, so it's very similar to how it was before. I'm going to pick user to find fixed tilt. I'm going to say rows and columns of um, two by fourteen in this case. Specify my tilt angle. Specify some of the other um, you know geometries similar to before that define what my standard table of two by fourteen modules is. And then once that's done, I'm going to use the same click and drag uh, feature. As before, I can specify a reference angle. So if I just want to do a square, I can uh, specify a square angle and click and drag out the first section square. Then I'm going to show you uh, if I want to have it angled more to, to line up with the boundary, I can do it as well, specify a reference angle, and uh, click and drag out the, uh, the reference angle as well and get a layout that way. Let me just go over to the summary tab. And you can see how easy it is to compare you know, different versions of your of your layout, uh, in this case, fixed tilt versus tracker. Um, you also have the option, of course, just to fill an entire area. So if you do click and drag and you specify the reference angle, um, you can just do fill rather than click and drag, of course, and it'll fill an entire area with fixed tilt um, tables as well.